Hi everyone, welcome back to our YouTube channel. I hope you are preparing well for a competitive exam as well as the academic exam and keep hard working to get your success and also, and also fulfill your dreams. Why? Because nowadays the competition among the nursing student is gradually increasing. Why? Because the population of the nursing student is increasing. Number of the vacancies are decreases. Right? Here ratio is also increases. Right? That's why I urge you to study clearly for all the competitive exams within the student life. That is your responsibility. And also get your success by hard working. Right? And also your parents are waiting for your success. And also your loved one also waiting for your success. That's why keep working hard to get a success and also and daily your time has to be dedicated to the competitive exams that is a one of the very important strategy to clear a competitive exam right i hope you are preparing well for a competitive exams and today we are going to discuss a one of the very important topic in the modern medicine that is stem cell therapy right so what in this video we are going to discuss uh, what is stem cell therapy and what are the types of stem cells and what are the benefits or advantages of the stem cell therapy and recently the scientists are working to uh, enhance uh, new innovations within the generative medicine right and also stem cell therapy is the one of the very important topic for a competitive exam as well as academic exam that's why i brought here to in front of you and let us discuss in detail right let's get started when we are talking about the stem cell therapy before going to the stem cell therapy we need to understand about the normal cells what is cell when you are defining the cell cell is the structural and functional unit of our body and mainly it can perform a very essential functions of our bodies such as it plays a very important role in the structure of the body each human being is made up of with the minute cells right in the human body there are millions of uh, cells right that's why it plays a very important role and normal cells have a similar characteristics they can divide they can reproduce they can perform a very essential functions and also helps in the structure right we already discussed in the second pc rbm right understanding the normal cells but Today's topic is very similar to the normal cells. Why? Because in the stem cells, when you are talking about the stem cells, stem cells are the specialized cells in our bodies. Mainly these specialized cells are present in the brain, teeth, muscles, intestine, heart, nerve and some other part of the body. And mainly in this type of the treatment, we are using the stem cells to treat uh, disorders and uh, recently the scientists are using a uh, stem cells to treat a uh, cancer cells right that's why this is a very important topic for a competitive exam as well as the academic exam that's why i brought this information in front of you and uh, uh, one uh, general thing that is the making informative video is a not an important thing the information has been transferred across the society is the important thing right why because we are the nursing students we are the nurses our responsibility has to be spreading awareness among the society among the all the health conditions that has to be deliver to the each and every individuals in the society right that is our responsibility that's why we have to join together to spread up more informative videos across the society 
right let's start a top main topic that is stem cell therapy when you are talking about the stem cell therapy so when you are defining the stem cell therapy it is a one kind of treatment and mainly this treatment uses a specialized cells mainly these specialized cells are present in our bodies examples like a heart nerve intestine muscles bone marrow even the blood right these specialized cells are using in the treatment and to treat a cells and to repair a damaged cells and also to generate new cells to generate new cells and also curing the diseases that is a very important function that's why stem cells are very important and even though the stem cells are also called as a generative cells generative cells in the modern medicine the stem cell therapy is one of the very essential treatment in the modern medicine that's why it's very important topic please watch up to the end of the video and gain a more information it's very important for a competitive exam as well as the academic exam mainly if there is any competitive exam most of the question coming from the stem cell right and uh, recently the scientists are working scientists are conducting the research on a stem cell therapy and in the future we will have a stem cell treatment very huge amount right that's why so when you are defining the stem cell therapy stem cell therapy is a kind of treatment mainly this treatment uses a specialized cells in our bodies right these cells have a similar characters to divide to repair to generate new cells and also cure a disorders or a damaged tissues or a damaged organs that is a definition of stem cell therapy right so this is all about definition of stem cell therapy and in the next we will move on to what are the types of stem cell therapy when we are talking about the types of stem cells there are three important stem cells are present in our body first one that is embryonic stem cell second one somatic stem cell and uh, third one that is induced pluripotent stem cells right so when you are talking about when we are talking about the mechanism of stem cell therapy so mainly these stem cell therapy is transplanted in the two different form first one that is injected and second one that is implanted right there are only two ways to introduce or administer a stem cell and when you are talking about the mechanism mainly it follows the three uh, actions and first one that is differentiation differentiation means these stem cells can uh, destroy or eliminate the dead cells as well as the dysfunctional cells dysfunctioning cells that is called as differentiation and second one that is paracrine signaling so mainly in this type of actions the stem cells are sending a signals or a growth factors or else these can release a cytokinase and also these can stimulate a inflammation and also these can make a repair of the damaged cells it is a second actions and third action that is immunomodulation mainly these stem cells can suppress the unwanted immunity response such as autoimmune reactions right these three are the very important actions of the stem cell therapy next benefits of stem cell therapy mainly the fda is approved that the stem cell therapy that can cure a hearing loss ear loss hearing loss right so why because the stem cells when you you are implemented so these can deliver the regenerative cells to the cochlea and also it makes a connection between the nerve connection to the middle ear right that's why it regain or a regenerative of the hearing of the person 
and also it is approved by the FTA, right? So one of the important function of the stem cell therapy. Second benefit that the stem cell therapy is also uh, using in a chronic disorder such as diabetes. So even though uh, the type 1 diabetes can be cured with the stem cell therapy. Why? Because the stem cells are ensuring the pancreatic beta cells that makes the in insulin regulations does not require an insulin injection to the type 1 diabetic patient. That's why stem cell therapy is a very important within the chronic disorders such as hypertension and uh, diabetes mellitus. Third benefit of the bone uh, stem cell therapy, it can also cure the cancers, blood and also uh, cancers. And mainly stem cells that can uh, generating the killer cells right these cells can cure uh, cancer cells these can destroy the cancer cells that's why the stem cell therapy is very important in the uh, cancer and uh, some other blood disorders and also it improves the improves the natural killing cells right and also against the cancers fourth benefit of the stem cell therapies is so these stem cell therapies the hematopoietin cells are a hematopoietin transplantation that makes a immunity reset or a improving the new resistance power within the immunity recently the research was conducted on a 20 years old man and completely and success is this uh, research and mainly the stem cells helping in the reset or a tolerance of the immunity right so even though sometimes the immunity has the unwanted responses like examples like autoimmunity right that can also prevent it by a stem cell therapy it plays a very important role next benefit that is drug development and a disease modeling even though the stem cell therapy can help in the modeling or a, a writing prescription of the new disorders and a drug administration, right? And also recently the researchers are studying a disease prescriptions based on the drug development. Drug development is also performed by a stem cell therapy, remember, right? So these are the some of the important benefits of the stem cell therapy and uh, nowadays research uh, scientists are recently the research is going on to improve uh, modern medicines with the stem cell therapy right so it is one of the very important topic thank you so much for watching and uh, thank you so much